Hi, this is Matt with AppliancePartsPros.com. Today we'll be showing you how to repair your appliance. Remember, anytime you work on an appliance, make sure it's unplugged or the circuit breakers are off so there's no chance of electrocution. In this video, we're going to show you how to change out the refrigerator or dishwasher or tine row. It's going to be a very easy repair and it's only take a few minutes to show you how to do it. If you already have one of these, great. If not, you can click on the link below or get it at AppliancePartsPros.com. When you open up the package, you're going to get the new tine row. The tine row holds the dishes in the lower rack. The manager should be changing it out if it's lost or damaged. In order to get to the part, we have to open up the dishwasher door. Once you have the door open, we're going to put a towel up on the counter to protect it from any scratches when we set the rack up there. Once you have the towel down, we can reach in and pull the lower rack out. Once you have it out, you can lift it off and set it on the towel. There's two tine rows in the back of the rack. They're both changed out the same way. In order to make it easier, we're going to lift the silverware basket out and set it aside. There's three tine row holders on each tine row. They all come out the same way. We're going to release the back locking tab first. It's the longer one. Just going to press on it to release it. And then we're going to lift up at an angle and get the front one to come out. Once you have the front released, you can lift it off the tine row. Once you have the last one released, you can just slide the front tab out and then just pull it off the tine row. Once you have the last one out, you can pull the tine row off the dish rack. Here's the old tine row next to the new one. If you already have one of these, great. If not, you can get it at ApplianceParsPros.com. When you put the new tine row in, you want to make sure the cap is on the left end, just like it was when we took the old tine row out. Once you have it lined up, we're going to put the tine row holder on the other end. All you have to do is set it down onto the tine, and then you can guide the front locking clip underneath. And once you have it in place, we can flex it so the rear one goes underneath. Once you have this one in, we can put the other two in. Once you have the last tine row holder on, we can put the silver or basket back in the rack and we can put the dish rack back in the dishwasher. To put the dish rack back in, all you have to do is set it on the door and push it back into place. Once you have it in, you can close the dishwasher door, take the towel off, plug it back in, take it for a spin. Thanks for joining us for another successful repair brought to you by AppliancePartsPros.com. Check out our other repair videos on our site, Facebook, and YouTube.